We're here with Joseph and Oscar who just won the BAFTA for Best Multiplayer with A Way Out. Now, you won a BAFTA for Brothers, A Tale of Two Sons. So yeah. this was the difficult second album. So two, for two. two for no two. No pressure on the next one. Actually, I'm quite sure we'll win the next one as well. <laughs> <laughs> I, know, I know I sound cocky, but I'm telling you, what we're doing now is super cool. I mean, Tell I can't talk about it. We'll come oh, really? Yeah, yeah, but you can't bring, bring it up and not yeah, but it's like, you know, you feel it in here. Like, when you, you're doing something that, you know, when the, the team and everybody's going crazy, that, you know, then we're on yeah, the next Yeah, I mean, level. you're mm -hmm. feeling it. Me from the outside, I need facts and details. Yeah, but you, so. you will get the facts when you get it in your hands. That's well, that's the thing. too yeah. far away. Yeah. But, like, A Way Out was, is actually so much, it's so different from Brothers. But, yeah. the, I mean, you can tell that, obviously, Obviously, some of the core mechanics have traveled over, but what yeah. did you want to make sure it was different? Like, what was the most sort of important thing to you? From, from a way out to, as mm. far yeah. from brothers to a way yeah. out. Mm. But the importance is to make an impact for the player. I like to, I mean, make, uh, create a feeling, an emotional feeling for the player and mm. try to mess or, or like, you know, like, almost like mind fuck the players a little bit. I love to do it, you know, like create a feeling of like you think the game is something, oh, uh, <laughs> you think the game is something, but then it changes something else. So that's really something. And I also love to use the mechanic mm. as part of the storytelling. Mm. Like for instance, mm -hmm. without spoiling, like in a way that something happens that really changes like mm -hmm. the, almost, you know, the situation in the couch with your friend. I love those situations mm. where you're really not sure what's going to happen next, you know. But does, I mean, that's a lot of pressure then for each game. Like you're always having to like oh, reinvent, you, reinvent uh, the uh, wheel uh, 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 every time you make a new game, game. Now this one, you've got to basically have the no, control no, no. on your head and stand on one leg. No, no, no. <laughs> yeah, but the next game is a true mindfuck moment. It was. Oh wow! What? Oh, you yes. Stop talking about yeah, it. Yeah, but I, I like the cheese. <laughs> for sake. The reason I really like that this one multiplayer is because it's not really typically what you think of as. A multiplayer game, right? Like yeah. that must be yeah. quite validating for you. But it's the it's the switch because we, you know, it used to be all couch co-op mm. and stuff like that, and then it all kind of went, oh, everyone's got an internet connection, mm. Ray, let's all like never see our friends again, and then it sort of brings it back once more, which is kind yeah. of it's nice. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I mean, the couch co-op, I think one of the reasons why it hasn't been back is because uh, you know when online gaming started to come, like mm. you know everybody was doing that. But I think it's underestimated. People want to play in their couch. But it's also a technical issue. It's not just mm. like, let's make a couch. I mean, mm. if you took Uncharted 4 and say, let's make a split screen, mm. it's going to like make the programmers and the graphic artists, you know, like shoot themselves in the head. Because there's so much work. You have to yeah. like, you know, there's so much optimization, blah, blah, blah. There's so much technical stuff. So I think people want, developers want to make couch, but they don't have the opportunity. What do you think? Yeah, for sure. I mean, it's, it's, you have to do it from the start with the yeah. split screen in mind. O otherwise, don't even bother, I'd mm. say, because you have to, kind of have to downgrade everything in, yeah. in the end. So, so we did it from the start. It's going to be split screen, even if you're online. And that was the vision. Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it was all, always co-op, actually. Yeah. Never yeah. changed. I mean, everyone just needs two TVs. I mean, one TV in a lounge is... It's not, not enough. enough, frankly, yeah. It's not <laughs> enough, especially if there are two games in there. So, so obviously, the game has a real kind of feel of like a kind of like a crime thriller, like how much of that kind of, uh, like what was the kind of process in kind of blending that in? Because like Brothers was, you know, it was like a lot lighter, a lot sweeter, yeah. then it kind yeah. of like, the, just the feel and the tone of it was so very, very different. Yeah. I mean, and you've got a cinema of... background as well. Yeah. Yes, yes, I do. So it's, it's all about what the, what the design idea is, because first of all, like when you come up with the game at Hayes, like, it's, it's more like, a, it's more like, okay, wh wh what do we want to do with this game, you know? And then the story and everything comes to it. So, it's, so the whole idea, is based on what the pretty much mechanics. So if you, if 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 I know how the game is going to be played and what will happen, then mm. pretty much the story comes after. So it's never actually oh. the story first. It's more like, oh, okay. yeah, it's it's, yeah. it's opposite, the opposite most of the time. Okay. So, tell so, us so about in this case, yeah, so yeah, tell in us this about case, your next yeah. Game. <laughs> yeah. So in this case, it was interesting. Like you know, without spoiling it, I don't want to. But it's like, what happens if you put p two people together, create blah blah blah, and then mm -hmm. blah blah blah. Mm -hmm. So who was your favorite? You just told us nothing. <laughs> nothing yeah, but at this all. This is way out. Uh, the next one, I'm not yeah. going to tell you anything. Come on. But just tell be us. prepared for it. I'm telling you, you're going to love it. <laughs> so I know, but you're going to. We're probably uh, going to sit uh, down and play it together. Oh, of yeah, course yeah. we are. Like last time. Yeah. But um, so I know one of the characters was based on your brother. But yeah. like, was he your favorite? Do you have a favorite? I don't or? have a favorite actually. No. It's hard to say. It's so, it's so hard to talk about the games that actually come from Hezla because you can't really talk about them. You can't really have an opinion about them if you don't finish them. Mm. I mean, people who come to me and say, yeah, I played Half of a Way Out or The Beginning of Brothers, it doesn't like, you have to finish them. Yeah. That's a really weird thing in the industry. We're kind of like, 
you know, uh, like uh, statistically, away out has been like uh, up to 50 percent. They have finished like the game, which mm -hmm. is uh, like a good statistic. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Which is weird. Like imagine doing a movie and half the people were like Walking. went out. It's crazy. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I think like people are talking about like replayability. Like game should be long. Blah blah blah. Who gives a fuck? We're not pe people are not even finishing the game. Who has time? Who has time? But, I mean, but look, look. The problem is people are not even finishing the yeah. game. Yeah. Yeah. Why yeah. do you even care? Like. Who cares about replayability? Like we should focus. Like people should finish the game. So that's yeah. that's something also that actually makes it hard for me to talk about it right. without spoiling. Yeah. Because I need to spoil the games to talk about them. What their yeah. you know uh, uh, what their well, point is. I mean, you know, do you think like obviously we we have that problem like you know doing games journalism, being able to like expect it to kind of like play all these games mm. is, and it's impossible. And then sometimes if you've got like something like Red Dead, you can't possibly do yes. all of it. Mm. But I mean, do you think people are looking for kind of smaller because uh, you know you can have a very short game that creates a really powerful yeah. emotive legacy in a person mm. it hasn't got to be a hundred hours to leave that do you think people are more inclined to want get and, a bit more yeah. succinct and more know? specifically games like that, that you can play with someone else yes yeah if i think i'm sorry i must miss the question if oh I think... so i'm just saying do you think that there's a there's a shift in people wanting to have a slightly shorter the, it, gaming experience for yes, that yes, very yes. reason because you don't yes. want to like not finish a game that's no what i'm saying out. that's yeah. what i'm saying you have a uh, i think like a group of people that all most of the time younger without being like very prejudiced here but it is mm. that you know but i think uh, it's it's i hope and I think it will be. It's going to be more about the experiences and not. Uh, I mean, it's not interesting to ask like, how long is a game? Like, who gives a fuck really? Like, it should be what kind of game is it? What do I feel inside here? So I hope we're going towards that way. And I'm not against long games. If a long game is interesting, then it's fine. It's just, it's just that we shouldn't ask those questions mm -hmm. at all. Not neither the players or the publisher. No one. Like nobody questions. Like, oh, will I see that movie? How long is it, by the way? You know <laughs> yeah. what I mean? It's I mean, just, sometimes if it's two and a half hours or whatever, you're like. Yeah, maybe I'm not going. It's yeah, the opposite opposite opposite. Yeah. Actually. yeah, it's weird. But I think it's important that we stop talking about the length or, or like mm. the replayability, which is super weird. And you have people who replay, but it's a very few percentage, like really few mm. people. I mean, how often have you replayed the game? Not very often. Yeah, that's no, what I'm no. saying. And, that's the, and why do journalists, uh, you're a journalist, why yeah. do you take it up in every like re re <laughs> review? Why do you say like, oh, the replayability, like, who cares? I do you, don't. Yeah, I, but you should help you, out. You haven't even read Everybody stuff. should she help out. That. Look the Everybody should help out with this. Yeah, yeah. Just focus on the experience, yeah, yeah. what it is. No, I'm a firm you, believer in a one time, one play, all the fit, any, everything oh, only look, has look. a meaning because you make, it's like life. <laughs> like, you only get one go, yeah. so whatever you do, that uh, yeah, things yeah. only have meaning if you do it once. If you go back and change your answers. <laughs> Oscar, did you replay it? Have you replayed it many times? How Which many times? Out? Yeah. Well, being, a, be, being on a development team, I've played it more times than most people guys. probably. Yeah, like actually <laughs> too many times. <laughs> <laughs> there's a balance. That but there's a different here. thing when you're a developer because you play like, okay, I'm going to play this middle two hours yeah. a bunch of times. Yeah, that's yeah, it. Yeah. Back and the forth. whole way through probably thing. not But as a, as a parent of a small child, I can definitely attest to if someone says to me, the game is 200 hours long, that's Here. definitely something that's, okay, I'm going to finish this in 2025, probably, <laughs> yeah. because I don't have the time. So a short experience well, like, is just, start this. Yeah. I mean, I can see the end of it, and, and I know it's going to, you know, if it's so, an I impact mean, as well. Imagine how much time people, like developers, put the work and nobody even sees that. I know. Mm -hmm. It's so like, you know, you know sometimes how I feel games are? It's like we want a table full of, like, <laughs> food everywhere <laughs> and if it's when we want to only eat this and if it's not the yeah. food is there we'll like hate on it you know what i mean yeah. you know what i'm trying to say yeah, here yeah, yeah. Mm. so it's like it's sad and i think it's and i think again it's not about how long or short that doesn't even matter mm -hmm. it's about like what the experience is i, I don't think even that question should be asked yeah. mm. really wow well, and you should help the the, the you, right. you are the one that helps out here, you know? <laughs> I will, I promise. I yes, promise. God, I'm do. on a hot spot. I, yeah. Is it getting warm in here or is it just me? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you guys so much Thank and you. congratulations Thank you so much. again. Thank you very much.